Hello everyone, welcome to my Tinkercad 3D modeling video of the Star Wars Star Destroyer. This is part one of the making of series, where we'll be blocking out the shape of the Star Destroyer. Before I start modeling in Tinkercad, I usually switch to orthographic view. It's the flat view without any camera perspective, which makes it a lot easier to align all the shapes. I always start by creating the basic shapes of the Star Destroyer. It's pretty straightforward since it's shaped like a diamond. Here I'm blocking out the main body of the Star Destroyer. I rely a lot on basic shapes and use Boolean operations to cut and combine them. The work plane tool is my go-to for aligning shapes. I often add a box beside the model to help with this. The work plane tool lets you choose where you want to align your plane, adjusting the angle and axis as needed. It really helps me orient and move shapes with ease. I also use the viewport cube a lot to get different angles and perspectives on the model. Whenever I'm modeling something, I already have a rough idea in my head. It's easier when you're working on something that already exists. I also plan the 3D printing orientation while I'm modeling. I think about how the model will be printed, considering any overhangs or gaps for bridging. Since I use a Bamboo Lab 3D printer, I have more flexibility and a few extra considerations when dealing with overhangs and bridges. If you're looking to get one for yourself, don't miss out. Use my affiliate links in the description below. It helps support the channel a lot. And there you have it. We've finished the basic shapes of the Star Destroyer. I'm super excited for you to see part two, where we dive into all the cool details. If you enjoyed this, make sure to like and follow me for more fun videos on 3D modeling with Tinkercad for 3D printing. Oh, and don't forget, you can download my models on the Maker World website. Just search for the user Faye 3D Lab. I've got tons of 3D model spaceships waiting for you. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you in the next video.